Thank you. Now, the final category award is sustainability and recognition of outstanding international success in environmental solutions, clean energy innovation, materials and energy efficiency, as well as renewable energy, waste and water management, green building, smart cities and R&D collaboration. To present this award, please welcome the Deputy Director, Research Leader Northern Australia from the CSIRO Land and Water, Dr Chris Chilcott. Chris uh, was also one of the category judges too and I look forward to hearing your insight on that. Over to you. Great, thanks David. As Australia's National Science Agency, CSIRO is all about taking smart ideas and creating impact. These awards are all about recognising the entrepreneurs and private sector who take those smart ideas and turn them into products and service and into emerging export markets. The finalists for the Australian Export Awards Sustainability Category are Hydrobiology from Queensland, Metro Count from Western Australia, from New South Wales, Microbiogen, Plant Sensors from the Northern Territory, Sun Power Renewables from Victoria, Red Arc Electronics from South Australia, the Malian Group, Australian Capital Territory, True South Seafood from Tasmania. Good luck to all in the category. And the sustainability category winner is True South Seafood. Ah, oh, congratulations, all you Taswegians. You're going wild there. Um, the plans for your new factory sound really exciting, um, particularly in respect to restoring the marine ecosystems and using 100% renewable energy. What prompted you to diversify your, your export market? Oh, look, we just, um, we've got a goal of uh, zero fish by 2025, Koshi, and um, we've been seen as industry leaders in innovation and sustainability and, um, you know, improving the condition of our marine ecosystems is absolutely the, one of our top priorities. Yep. Um, how, how have you grown the export markets over the last year or so? Uh, tenacity, um, grit and um, diversification. Yeah, explain that. And, Explain the diversification. So, I'm turning a, yeah, an invasive marine species, which is the, the central Stephanus sea urchin, into not only a world-class uh, seafood product, which we export all over the world, but we're now turning the waste from that processing into a uh, an organic, viable fertiliser uh, for agriculture industries. And we're doing that using 100% renewable energy. I can sense your passion for this at a time where the industry is under a bit of focus, isn't it? Um, the commercial fishing industry about its environmental impact. Um, you seem just so determined to turn that perception around. Absolutely, because it's, um, it's, it's where we generate our business from. It supports... Um, a lot of families across regional areas in Tasmania, from the amazing people I've got behind me who are our employees to, you know, our, our dive families who are sort of located around the state. And without this industry, without this amazing natural resource, without, you know, if we don't take steps to look after it, it's not going to be there for future generations. So, yeah. Look, congratulations. Pass on our congratulations to the team behind you. You look a really close-knit bunch and you deserve every accolade. Thanks, Koshi. They're, they're awesome. It's all about these guys. Good on you. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that great? Uh